hey guys it's Lamise O welcome back to the channel in today's video I am coming to you guys with an easy homemade chicken noodle soup recipe I made a homemade stock if you haven't seen that chicken stock video go ahead and watch that video that way you guys can um, know how I make the stock that I'm about to use in this recipe but before we get started I want you guys if you haven't subscribed please go ahead and subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell so you can get notified every time I upload so with all that being said I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera around so I can show you guys exactly what you need to make this recipe so to make this you are going to be needing one cup of cubed onions one cup of cubed celery sticks and one cup of cubed carrots i have some thyme that i'll be using and i have some fresh parsley that i'll be using for garnish and i have one clove of garlic that i already chopped up you are going to be needing about six to seven cups of fresh homemade um, chicken stock again that card that just popped up will take you to that video of the stock you are going to be needing some pasta this is the type i'm using okay about three two to three cups of pasta this is the chicken that i used to make my stock i went ahead and shred it up so i'm going to be using a good amount of that and you are going to be needing a little bit of olive oil and of course some salt and pepper to taste please check the description box where i will list everything i use in this video so let's get cooking guys you want to go ahead and set your stove to medium high i'm going to drizzle a little bit of olive oil a couple teaspoon of olive oil into that pan we don't need much oil as you can see and now you want to go ahead and add that um, onion one more thing i forgot to mention i am going to be using a couple bay leaves on this even though i used some bay leaves in my um, stock when i was making it i like the smell that it gives my soup and let this sweat for about two to four minutes now you want to go ahead and put in that garlic if it will all come out and i'm just going to let that cook for a few minutes as well make sure you are stirring it as it's cooking just like that now go ahead and add your celery and i'm going to add the carrots also i love making chicken noodle soup i love eating chicken noodle soup especially in the winter months or even the fall i just love making this so much if you haven't please go follow us on facebook twitter snapchat and instagram you can find me on pinterest as well i will leave all the links down in the description box for you to check us out so I'm going to let this saute for another three to five minutes. Now I'm going to go ahead and add that thyme, just so I can release some of that oil from that thyme. Just cook it for a minute. And now go ahead and put in that broth. Remember I said I will use about seven cups of broth. If I need, I might add a little more, but this look pretty good. I might add, add one more cup. And now you want to go ahead and taste. I know I didn't have too much salt in my broth, so I'm going to go ahead and season that water. Add a little bit of black pepper as well. And add your bay leaves. And stir everything up. Again, I'm going to add another extra cup of liquid so that will make it eight cups and allow this to come to a boil once it start boiling then we can add our pasta so our pasta can cook in that water 
Now that my water is coming to a boil, you wanna go ahead and put in that pasta. You can either cook your pasta separately or you can cook it in here. Since I know I'm going to eat this all today, throughout the day we'll be eating it. So I'm going to go ahead and just add my pasta in. But again, if you plan on saving this, you can definitely cook the pasta separately. And when you are eating your soup, you can add your pasta to your soup. So now I'm going to allow it to cook until my pasta is cooked, but I don't want it to be too mushy. So make sure you keep an eye on it. Again, cook it until your pasta is cooked, then we can add our chicken. Now I am going to remove that thyme. Don't burn yourself, be careful. And I can see my pasta is not cooked all the way yet. So now with clean hands, you wanna grab some chicken and you can put as little or as much chicken. Mine is mainly the breast that I chopped up. I chopped up both of the breasts from the whole chicken. I like big chunks of chicken on mine as well. I think this should be enough. And if you want, you can definitely use some egg noodles. I know sometimes it makes the gravy a little thicker. And now just allow this to heat through completely, maybe for like eight minutes, and then we should have our chicken noodle soup. Okay guys, my soup is all done. I went ahead and chopped some parsley and just kind of sprinkle right on top of it. I'm not sure if you guys can see, I don't want to dump that, but you guys will definitely see it in the pictures. It is not too thick, it's still watery, just how chicken noodle soup should be. If you want, you can definitely add some cream to it if you want it creamy, but this is comfort food that I could eat every day, regardless if I'm sick or not. Most people love chicken noodle soup when they're not feeling good, but I could eat this all the time. So I'm gonna go ahead and give it a taste. Take some chicken with everything, it's super hot. It smells so good. Chicken noodle soup to me always smell like Thanksgiving. Mm. This is definitely comfort food. When you, make, when you make it at home, it just makes it 10 times better. I hope you guys try this recipe. If you do, if you like it, let me know. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite soup is. And thank you guys so much for watching. Again, give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys for watching. Bye-bye.